Our KXAN investigation out of Kyle last night has a lot of people talking today. At issue, an $800 parking ticket written by Kyle police to a man who did not even get out of his car or put it in park for that matter. Scott Wallace says when he was finished grocery shopping, he pulled the car around while his friend finished checking out with the cashier. That's when a Kyle police officer came up, lights flashing, and wrote him a ticket. He said, well, can you not read the sign on the curb? It says no parking. And I said, well, I'm, I'm not parked. I'm just standing. I'm still in drive, and my seatbelt's still on. I haven't, haven't exited my vehicle. In my mind, that's what parking means. Just because you're sitting in your car in a fire lane doesn't make it legal to still stop your vehicle and remain in that fire lane. Yeah. Kyle police tell KXAN's Chris Willis they've written about 10 of these tickets in the past six months, and they do use discretion and give verbal warnings when it's appropriate. But the story has hit a nerve with some of you posting comments on our website and Facebook page. For instance, Richard writing in, isn't the HEB parking lot considered private property? How can they enforce traffic laws on private property? Then David adds, if they are going to do it, do it to everyone, not just a handful of tickets within six months of time. If it's such a safety hazard, enforce it. And finally, Tony writing in, I guess you'd better ticket me for waiting at my daughter's school to pick her up at 245 and the other 20 cars that do the same thing. Kyle Police, if you're going to do sting operations, do it for something that's actually a crime. You can post your thoughts at KXAN.com or on our KXAN Facebook page here. The driver, Scott Wallace, has a court date set for early December. We will, of course, let you know what happens.